hello everyone my name is ishmael and and welcome to today's video you know as i was looking at today's video i tried by all means to make it you know uh on how i can be more direct but i just believe that whoever it's meant for you will understand and what it's really talking about so i'll try to keep it as short as i possibly can listen in the book of genesis chapter 24 i like talking about this a lot these stories and all but eliaza ask for a sign where if the woman is going to offer him water as well as his camels to drink that would be the one that the lord has ordained for his master's son abraham which was isaac so i'm telling you that your ordained spouse will ask for water even if it's not actually water literally water in your your side but you find there are things that your ordained spouse is going to ask and play no games okay there's a thing that if games had to get those things were real were valid you will see many people married today you will see many people with lasting relationships like yes because i first played hard to get and now look at us now nah, like it doesn't work in fact for men whenever you are playing hard to get get game against him the more he's determined is because back in his mind some of these evil men or most of them is because they are thinking that they are not thinking that once they get you they won't let you go no they are thinking that once they get you they're gonna make you pay for giving them playing those hard to get games for giving them that tough time that's why some women after those men sleep with them they dump them they leave them because you are still angry that you're ignoring him you're making him look like he's stupid look making him look desperate so in fact that does not solve any problem and that can even make matters worse. But when it's something from God himself, just like the case of Eliza and Rebecca, nothing's going to go wrong. She didn't play any games. She just offered him water. She didn't try to act like, oh, no, let me not act interested. Let me not. Because at first, he didn't even know that uh, he was asking the water for himself or whether he was the one interested or not. Perhaps in the back of her mind, you thought maybe this old man if he was an old man i don't know how old he was but i, I i'm sure at some point she at some level she felt like maybe he likes me huh, but let me not be rude like you get what i'm saying because he had not said his uh, made his intentions clear and all but she played no games and listen her not playing games became a verification into elias that she is the one but what if she had refused it means he would have thought and would have assumed that she is not the one because the one that he had prayed about, prayed for, is supposed to offer him water to drink. So, listen, try to be at your best behavior. Ask God Almighty to guide you. He will guide you, in fact. Don't try to overthink everything. Just go with the flow. If you're someone who's always been playing games, someone who's always trying to, and you at that moment you felt like just letting go and doing for going with the flow, watch watch carefully because that could be the way in which God is directing you. So don't miss it, okay? And I pray may God Almighty help you in Jesus' mighty name. Just check in my DM for prayer requests and spiritual advice, okay? The details are in the description of the video below. I mean, check on the description below for DM as well as email. And that's for me. I will see you next time. Stay blessed.